It's a first trip to title town for Emilio Gomez. Hard earned, well deserved. Gomez, your champion in Tallahassee. 6 2, 6 2 over Tommy Paul. It is a first trip inside the top 200 as well for the former UFC Trojan. Mike Cation here with the Tallahassee Tennis Challenger champion, Emilio Gomez. Your first challenger title. You've had two finals now in your three weeks. To have this first championship, what does it mean here today, especially after that performance? Uh, it was uh, really good, actually. Like, I felt really good during the whole week. And, you know, to come and play the final, the best match of the whole week, it was just amazing, amazing feeling. I was super calm all the time, you know, I think that was key to uh, to keep my composure and, you know, be, be able to play the tennis I played today. I mean, I'm really proud of myself, how things have been going lately, and uh, I just... I just need to keep going because I think it's more to come. Yeah, this is the first time you've been inside the top 200, yeah. which doesn't happen too often for somebody who's at the age of 27. What are the improvements that you've been able to make over the last year or two that has led you to this point? I think mentally it was it was uh, key. I mean, I've had some like tough injuries uh, in the last years, and so I think that kind of like was the worst moment. And but at the time it was the the turning point for my mm -hmm. career, you know, I was having super hard time and, you know, now to be able to be here, it was, it's just pleasing, you know, it's just, it's just amazing how hard I work for it and it's just part of the game, you know, 27 years old and, you know, I think uh, I'm just starting to, to my uh, new career, you know. It's very rare uh, when you're in a final, and this is your second final, but to have a performance like this, where it seemed like you were anticipating reading Tommy so perfectly, on top of that, coming up with some amazing gets, challenging him throughout, what was the difference for you today? Uh, you know, he had already a big win in Sarasota. You know, I knew this match, I had to do it physically from the start, physical from the start, so uh, I think that was key. You know, I needed to get the first set for mm -hmm. sure, so he kind of felt the pressure and you know because he was going to get tired at some point if he if i was that's why i kept making and making balls bringing back balls that i knew i could get back and you know it's just it's just amazing how everything worked i mean everything worked perfect well we have to go because the doubles final is about to start but what is the way to celebrate your first challenger title here in tallahassee uh, i will be driving to savannah <laughs> I mean, that's the way, so uh, I'll probably uh, have a good meal and go yep. back to Savannah and, you know, get back to work tomorrow. You know who you potentially play in the third round, right? I know. Yeah, Tommy And he Paul. knows, too. <laughs> he knows it, too. I know, I probably. Well, Emilio, yeah. I know there are a lot of people uh, who you've made connections with over the last couple of years. You mentioned you've trained in Orlando. Uh, obviously, your ties at USC. A lot of people very happy for you. So what do you want to say to your fans, uh, your friends, after your first title? Well, uh, this is all for them. You know, I've, I've worked so hard for this, and it's for my family too that they actually believe to you know still 27 years old and you know to keep uh, working and you know now uh, get back to work and you know like get get bigger dreams you know Emilio Gomez your champion at the Tallahassee Tennis Challenger